Hey y'all, it's Kara from the Transformation Mom for ABCDE, and I had another little bit of a haul that I got, and um, this is a lot of books that I got, and then these five little trivia cards. So I was thinking about doing some prayer journals, and I had got that blue fabric with the white, and then this is just little bio trivia cards so I thought this might be fun to actually put in there I had got some coloring scripture coloring pages and got some other things so those are coming right along first book I got is digest of world literature and so what I thought was kind of cool about it is like here's some mouse and wonderland pictures there is you know it talks about different things um, this is Anderson's Fairy Tales. There's Benjamin Franklin. So there's a lot of cool pictures in here, but there's also a lot of the stories. And one of the things was is that Nick the Booksmith is doing a challenge on classics. I'm doing a tome on a classic, and it was in there, so I'm gonna use some of those for that. I found this book that's called Okinawi Swamp. Let me see if I can get my camera a little bit over here without trying to tear down the whole thing. So this book had a lot of different cool pictures and wildlife and contrasts and um, I can see doing quite a few nature journals with a lot of the pictures from this. I got this Encyclopedia of World History. So again, I just thought it was really, really neat. One of the things with this one is this is 1948. So it has all kinds of different, um, you know, the, uh, just the world history from then. And so um, I think it's really neat because, you know, it really only goes up to, I think, 1920, 1938, I think was the oldest I saw in here. So. Um, to see how the countries have changed since then. So that was a cool different book. I found this book of airplanes, and I don't know why, but I just fell in love with this one too. This one was 1971, but it had all the different old war planes in it. So I could see kind of making something out of this one. Uh, I found this book, and it reminded me of the jungle. No, this one was, this is 1961. This one reminded me more of, again, nature. It has bugs in it and fun flowers and everything else. So I really, really like that one. And again, I can see using that in a garden journal. This one's called The Burning Mountain. And again, it's another oldie. This is 65. And so, um, it kind of reminded me of the jungle. This was the one that I was saying. So, you know, it has a volcanic eruption. And uh, so, it just, that was kind of cool. I found this book. Now, this book had this little tear out in the front. And you can see it has some prints in it which are really pretty. So again, I can see using these in nature journals or, you know, something like that. But this is called Discovering World Animals. And it's a Reader's Digest um, thing. And it is copyrighted in 1971. But I absolutely love monkeys. And so I... Just, there was some really awesome pictures in here. Look at all the seals and the wal walruses and um, birds and deer and, you know, just a little bit of everything you can imagine. So, I can see using this book a lot. Then I found this big guy. And this is an encyclopedia. And again, it is rather old. So, this one says 1940. And it's just an ens 
just, you know, it kind of is just a little bit of an encyclopedia. So all I can see finding things that I, you know, would like if I'm doing a, a journal about gardening, I might pull out the picture of gardening. Or if I'm doing a seed journal, like under the seed journal, I might do eels or whatever. So this was a huge find. So that was kind of exciting. And the last one I think is one of my favorites because it was just so unique. So this is from the Towstone and Hollingsworth Company. It says, paper used in the directory is made in Boston by manufacturers of paper of old fashioned quality. Okay. Now look at this gorgeousness. So look at all the old ads and um, just, you know, it, this book you can tell was loved and used and um, it says here's the population in the United States. And um, you can see that Alaska, Hawaii, and Puerto Rico when this was done was territory. They weren't even states. So this book just really blew me away. You can, um, I mean, it just talks about all the different um, commercial and industrial reviews. It gives you, you know, here's the port and the size of the ports. Um, it just, you know, city directories and, you know, businesses. And, I mean, it just has all kinds of old ads in it. And it I mean, it's just page after page after page. Um, and it, I'm pretty sure it looks like an old phone book. And then you can see in the back there's all the different old ads. So this book was one of those I was really surprised to find. And I was loving the... You know, I'm just old enough to probably remember a phone book. The generation before after me probably doesn't but the yellow pages and the and the pink pages um, so this just um, blew me away and I was very excited to find this so I'm excited to use this one too so that was my haul of books for today I'm hoping to get in some projects I gotta finish some Valentine's Day stuff so I'm hoping to get those filmed and I hope you guys just have a really really awesome day